All right, so today's video, we're gonna be talking Mazda. We're gonna be talking about models using this key. Uh, you will encounter models where the uh, security has been updated by Mazda. And when you select yes on your tester to using the bypass, it does not bypass. Um, what you wanna do is uh, go back and select no, you do not wanna bypass. And it will uh, generate a series of numbers that needs to be converted on the Mazda site. And um, advanced diagnostics tech support will not help you navigate the Mazda site at all. Um, but we are going to put together a little video to kind of help you. Um, so the first step is to use your favorite search engine, Mazda service info. And once you get to the Mazda site, uh, Mazda has set up two areas for to be able to do this. One is specifically for <clears throat> the security professional uh, where you uh, enter your locksmith ID and such and it will cost $20 and it will generate a D1. So this is completely linked to your locksmith ID. But there also is an area where up in the top here, you select the mobilizer codes and you can buy a $35 24 hour access subscription, which does not create a D1 and you do not need a locksmith ID in order to convert the codes. Uh, you will have to create an account though with Mazda. So if you just click login, register and fill out the info, uh, there is a weird stipulation about the email exceeding 20 characters. So just watch that. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and log in and uh, I'll come right back. All right, so I have logged in uh, and purchased my 24 hour pass for $35, uh, which does not create a D1. And we're gonna select, after you're done with that, you select immobilizer codes and what we are looking for is a mobilizer code word. So this is where you want to enter all the information. And a picture of what the tester provides you looks like this. So this is what uh, the information that needs to be converted here. I'm going to go ahead and enter it. Now it's looking for the part number, P, Y, F, L, dash, one, eight, 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 one. And the serial number is going to be nine, 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 nine. The error control number is going to be five, one, four, E, eight. Our out code is uh, 8D0CBO. And the reason is for reprogram key. And we are going to click submit. And it gives you a message Mazda will email you in about uh, 15 minutes the code. And this is what it looks like when you enter it in the tester. So it's going to give you, Mazda is going to email you a four digit code that you enter uh, back into the tester to allow you into programming.